going on guys? I do from Walmart back here today with a brand new video. And today guys, uh, we're gonna be taking one of my dogs to the vet pretty much. There's the baby right there. <laughs> But uh, basically the reason why I'm taking her to the vet pretty much is because she's been having some problems going on with her right leg. She hasn't been getting, wanting to use it at all. I mean, she hasn't been wanting to get up and do a lot. So I'm going to take her by the vet here. I'm just going to see what they can do. Basically her kneecap kind of popped out of place pretty much. Gave me some pain medicine to give to her. They said it may have to require surgery. It just kind of depends on how it goes. I don't know yet guys. I just hope she gets better because there you go man. That's just going to be a lot. But anyways, I'm on the way home and I guess just kind of find a way to resume this video really. I mean, I didn't really have a specific idea but I know I want to try to get a video out this week. Alright, so I'm gonna be real with y'all right now. It's been a couple weeks since I've picked this camera up. Mainly just due to the fact that I haven't really had much content to record and hadn't really been working out. I got some new content for y'all today. Guess what came in the mail today? These nuts! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> got him! <laughs> package did come in the mail today. This is a Nylite LED light bar. Basically, I'm just gonna be installing this on a four wheeler pretty much. Kind of giving you a look at it like a little install. Pretty much, yeah, just an install video. Basically, this is just my wires. This right here is my mounting kit. I honestly have no idea what this is. Then the piece, the resistance light itself, man. Dude, this thing actually looks so beautiful. Man, but you know, the kind of technology, TV, lights, whatever, console, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta do it right, man. You gotta do it exactly right. Oh, oh my, oh. Oh, yeah. But anyways, this is what she looks like. And I'm wanting to put it right there. So, just kind of see really how it would go, pretty much. We're going to see if we can try our hand in installing this thing. Wish me luck and hope I don't catch my four-wheeler on fire. But first, I'm going to mount it on the front of my four-wheeler and uh, try to figure out the wiring. That's going to take a while. Right, so, I just got the mounts installed. Basically, I'm fixing to go on ahead and install the light bar, pretty much. I'm just going to go on ahead and say this now. Nobody on YouTube can help me put this on. What I'm saying by that is, I'm trying to figure out how to get this piece to go on right here and how I'm supposed to do it exactly, but I think I just figured it out. So we're going to do it ourselves pretty much and hope for the best, really. But uh, if you are looking for like an install guide on how to do this, yeah, you've come to the wrong place. Really, I can probably give you a couple tips on how I did it, but honestly, some of this stuff isn't really that hard whenever you figure it out because all the parts are together. But I'll get back to you guys in a second. All right, well, uh, I just got the brackets on pretty much. I, I doubt seriously I even did this right, and if you're wondering what this is, this actually came with it. It's actually helped hold these right here in place. I just put them under here because my whole bar is pretty much messed up. Honestly, man, it actually kind of looks pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie to you. What we got left is the wiring, pretty much. Basically, I gotta deal with all of this. Getting it wired to my battery and everything. It's gonna be so fun. So I was trying to figure out why this thing wasn't wanting to cut on, right? I'm about as dumb as you get, pretty much. I'm not smart. So basically, whenever I went to hook this in, I didn't have, like, my positive battery cable hooked back up. So it wasn't wanting to work right. So I got my positive. There's my negative terminal. Basically, that's what runs all the way back. Your cord. I don't have it hooked up to the light bar yet because I'm still trying to figure out how to do it because I really don't want to mess this up. But I do know I'm doing it right because this is how. A little light off in there. If you cut it off, it cuts itself off. So that's how I know I'm doing it right. I'm going to try to find like a little ground. I can hook that little fuse tapper thing or whatever. I, I'm not really sure what they call it. I, I'm still trying to figure this thing out really. But basically, I'm just leaving this one exposed because I have another another couple right here because i lost the other thing to that but that cat come on no no we're gonna see if this works or not yes it works oh my god wow that is bright jeez okay so so the light bar does work let's go i i can't believe it right, let me go ahead and cut that off before i drain my battery all right so the tutorial i watched on this one guy told me that uh, whenever you've got this light if this light comes on you know you're doing it right well, I guess I am. I'm just trying to figure out how to get these two right here figured out because I couldn't 
get them figured out to start with, but I'm gonna take these two off and then put the other ones back on. All right, this is the final product, really. I put my switch right here. That way, whenever I get ready to use it, cuts right on. Basically how I wired it was I took the plastic off right here and just kind of ran a bunch of your wires off through here pretty much and ran it all the way back up here. And back here, basically just kind of had it wired up and everything. Just kind of ran it up right back there. But anyways, yeah, I'd say this probably took about three hours mainly because I couldn't get it figured out on how to wire it. YouTube did not help me one bit, so I finally just kind of messed around with it and I figured it out. I mean, honestly, I, I, I'd say she looks pretty clean. Dang, she does look a whole lot better. But anyways, yeah, that's going to be it as far as wiring this thing. So uh, let me get on here and give her a little spin. All right, man, well, uh, that's going to be it for this video. I want to say sorry for the terrible mic quality, but I am using my headset mic. So I'm going to go on ahead and get this video edited for y'all. I'm actually in the process of editing it now. I'm almost done, actually, but... I completely forgot that I didn't record an outro. Well, I mean, I did record the outro, but there's no audio. So I'm going to go on ahead and try to get this video edited for you guys and get it out to you guys tomorrow or later today. I, I, I'm not really sure. Probably more than likely tomorrow. I'm going to try to also start on another video tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see how it goes because this next weekend, it's going to be busy. I'm not really sure whether I'm going to have to work all weekend this next weekend. just depends on whether or not the state can get the job contracted or not. Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy the video, be sure you hit the thumbs up down below. And uh, click the subscribe button for more content. Because, guys, we are so, so close to 50 subscribers, man. I mean, I think we're at 45 right now. We are five, five subscribers away, man. Honestly, bro, i really like to see us reach 50 because it's my lifelong dream to be... A a YouTuber. I just want that dream to come true, man. Anyways, I guess that's going to be it for this video. I'll see you on the next one.